Hey, what's up, guys? David Sebo, another video, and today I'm going to be looking at uh, the SIM tray of this phone, the Samsung Galaxy A33 5G, and also testing out its OTG Bluetooth with the flash and the, the hard drive. This is one terabyte hard drive HDD. Yeah, so this is not solid state. It's a good old yeah HDD. Let's go ahead and uh, remove the SIM tray. So you basically just place. The SIM ejector tool to the yeah to the SIM tray there, right on your on your left when the phone is when the phone is facing you like yeah you just want to touch it in on your left at the end remove it yeah right so yeah this is your SIM tray and uh, it's basically a hybrid SIM tray so you can have two SIM cards or one SIM card and uh, an SD card let's go ahead and uh, try the SIMs in. Right, so basically it's SIM 1 here and SIM 2 here or micro SD card. So right, so let's put the first SIM card in. So that's your SIM 1 right there. And uh, SIM 2 uses the shared slot. So this shared slot can have a micro SD card or yeah, this SIM card, SIM 2. So yeah, that's basically the configuration of this, the SIM card. You can have the two SIM cards or so we have one SIM card and an SD card. So yeah. That's what the SIM cards, SIM, SIM trays are like. That's what the SIM trays are like for this year. So you can no longer have, you can no longer have the whatever, two SIM cards at once with a, an SD card as well at the same time. So you have to just choose between, yeah, which is a bummer. For those of us who like using uh, the dual SIMs and uh, yeah, and an SD card at once. 128 gigs is really not enough, so you have to buy the 26 gig now. Okay, so let's go ahead and test the OTG. Basically, using uh, an adapter here, OTG adapter from Samsung itself. Let's go ahead and test it and see. Great, and uh, it's clearly supported, no issues here. You can basically open and remove it, just unmount. So that's good. That's all good. Let's go ahead and try and see. If actually it will connect to this hard drive here, right? As you guys can see, so yeah, this cable comes with the hard drive. I just connected it there and uh, connected it to the OTG adapter. And uh, let's go ahead and try out and see. It's actually going to connect. <laughs> I'll be surprised if it does. As last year it couldn't. Let's see. Well, wow, it's actually connected. Let's see if we can read it actually. I'll be surprised if it does read it. I actually thought that only USB 3 ports can read this drive. I'm actually surprised now that it's being read by this tiny phone. Wow, so I can actually read, read that. Wow, that's beautiful, guys. So, yeah. Drive is actually connected. Wow. So yeah, I think that's it for the video, guys. So basically, to unconnect or uh, disconnect it, you're going to just unmount the, the disk right there and uh, just basically plug it out. So yeah, guys, that's it for this video, and uh, catch you guys in this video. Peace out.